Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. said, and I quote, the most important step we can take is that short walk to the ballot box. He said, a voteless people are a powerless people. And the most important step we can take is that short walk to the ballot box. Those who vote control income, education, health care, housing, and justice. Those who don't vote do not control income, education, health care, housing, and justice. So we have to walk to that ballot box. If you're sick of being tired, if you're really ready for change, then we have to walk. Do more than just talk. We have to get our ballots arranged. If you want a bigger piece of the pie and more than minimum wages, if you want higher income, you have to bring some balance to the voting cages. You say you want better schools. Well, you hold the key to the locks. You want higher education. Find a voting station and walk to that ballot box. If you're ill but can't see a doctor because your hospitals are all closed, if you're lacking health care, you best be where your vote is your only repose. You say you want better housing and peace in your neighborhood, then remember your vote. It's the only bank note that can purchase any good. And if you really, truly want justice, then cash in some bonds and stocks. Make it your payday next election day and walk to that ballot box and take some friends and family members with you. Hear this foolishness about you're not going to vote. After all our ancestors fought and died for, you're not going to vote. Please. Remember, income, education, health care, housing, and justice are all controlled by the vote. We have to vote. We have to walk to that ballot box. Dr. King said, and again, I quote, A voteless people are a powerless people, and the most important step we can take is that short walk to the ballot box. Spreading this ridiculous narrative about not voting. Please. All of our ancestors who fought and died so that we could vote. You better walk. You better walk to that ballot box. Remember Harriet Tubman, Frederick Douglass, Sojourner Truth. All these people died so that we could vote. Henry Box Brown and Louis Latimer. Henry Box Brown shipped himself in a box for freedom. Gary A. Morgan, Benjamin Banneker. Granville T. Woods, abolitionists like Mary Prince, David Walker, Benjamin Pat Singleton, William Purvis and Robert Purvis. Remember these people, we owe them. Sarah Parker Redmond, Francis E.W. Harper, and Francis Harper, the woman abolitionist. These people fought and died so that we could vote. Henry Highland Garnett, the Reverend Richard Allen, Absalom Jones, and Paul Cuffey, Jarena Lee, remember Moses Dixon, Ida B. Wells, John Mercer Langston, Nat Turner, Gabriel Prosser, all these folk, Denmark Bessie, folk like Fannie Lou Hamer, Shirley Chisholm, thousands died, yea, even millions died so that we could vote. We have to walk to that ballot box. We have to walk to that ballot box. Remember our ancestors deserve it. They deserve it.